Rajwinder Singh was taken from Delhi's Tihar prison to the local airport just behind me. He was escorted by seven police officers in a van and when he arrived at the airport he was met by Australian authorities. He was then taken through the main entrance with many other passengers waiting to go in for their flights around but he was surrounded by several authorities by this stage. He was then checked onto a Qantas flight from New Delhi to Melbourne which left on Tuesday evening. Now at the boarding gate Indian authorities handed over Mr Singh to Queensland police who will be guarding him on that flight. Now the fact that Mr Singh is being extradited so soon after he was arrested in November last year is quite unusual here in India. These extradition cases have been known to go for many years, some of them lasting more than a decade but Mr Singh had told the courts here in New Delhi that he wanted to be extradited, that he wanted to go to Australia to fight these charges. We understand that once he arrives, he will face charges over the alleged murder of Toya Cordingly, a woman who was found on a beach north of Cairns in 2018. Her family have been waiting several years for any updates on this case, and this brings them one step closer to seeing a trial in a courtroom in Australia.